Feeling good, have lots of energy. I'm eating delicious food. I officially have the best hack ever. If I can fit in a mini Cornetto into my day, you bet I will. <laughs> I love this meal. I would honestly say it's one of my favorites. Good morning guys and happy Tuesday. I think, yeah, it's Tuesday today. So if you guys saw my last vlog, you would know that I'm doing like a mini cut series. If you haven't seen that one, definitely go back and watch it because I kind of talk more about like why I'm doing it and the benefits I want to see from it. So definitely check that out if you haven't seen that one already. But I wanted to start this week's weekly vlog, I guess. I am starting it a day late just because yesterday I was not in the best mood. <laughs> um, but today I'm feeling so much better. I had like 12 hours sleep last night, which is insane. I am two weeks in at the moment and I'm feeling pretty good. I'm 1.2 kilograms down, which I think is quite good for what I'm on right now because I'm not in a very strict deficit. I'm just kind of like at 10%. So yeah, I jumped on the scales this morning and I felt pretty good seeing that number. I'm not really doing it for like a weight loss goal in particular, but obviously it's good knowing that what I'm doing at the moment is working. So yeah, feeling good, have lots of energy. I'm eating delicious food. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would still see that I'm eating like all of the food. Done. We ended up going for like an hour, which is unheard of because I feel like home workouts we usually do like half an hour to 45 minutes, but it felt like a pretty good sesh, so I'm happy with that. Um, now we're just making some dinner, so I've got some rice cooking in here. We've got some chicken there, no one wants to see raw chicken. And we're making teriyaki bowls. I think I've made this on my channel at least like five times now, we're obsessed. Um, so yeah, we just use this sauce. I'm gonna put some like broccoli and stuff on, maybe a touch of kewpie mayo, just to tie it all together. And then yeah, that's what we're having for dinner. Super, <laughs> super simple, just literally chicken, broccoli and rice. How Jimmy can you get? <laughs> but we're obsessed, I don't know why. I love this meal. I would honestly say it's one of my favorites and Andy can agree. Right? Yep. Yep. <laughs> anyway, let's make some dinner. walk and I'm now enjoying a bowl of yogurt and granola this takes me back to when I first started my weight loss journey like six to seven years ago 
I literally ate yogurt with granola and a green tea every single day for I'm gonna say minimum two years, possibly even more. And then I kind of got over it. Like I think I had it too much that I just did not like yogurt and granola anymore. But the weather has been so beautiful in Melbourne recently. It's been a little bit warmer, but it's also been so sunny. Like even right now, it's just blue sky, which is amazing. So I felt like granola and yogurt this week. And so far I am obsessed with it. I don't know why I stopped because it's honestly so good. Highly recommend if you haven't had it in a while. It's just, it's chef's kiss. So I just got back from Woolies. I had to go grab some lunch food because on Sunday when we did our weekly shop, they didn't have what I wanted in stock. So I've just been eating like random things. Like yesterday I had a toasted sandwich. So today I thought I would go back and see if they had the things that I wanted so that I can make it this week. And they did. And I'm very excited about it. Um, my client has had this for like two weeks nonstop and she sent me a photo the other day and I was like, I now want that so badly. So, I bought, first of all, I bought burger thins. I pretty much have these most weeks, if not every second week, because I'm obsessed. And then the thing that I wanted were these chicken burgers with zucchini and parmesan. I've had them before and they were really good, but she had it with like a burger and like egg, bacon, tomato, lettuce, and it just looked so good. These chicken burgers actually have really good macros as well. So they're only 142 cals per serve. So I did also buy bacon. Yeah, I don't have bacon very often, but again, it was just, it's all part of the whole craving, you know? And then I got two little sneaky snacks. The first thing I got are mini Cornettos. I love these. They are 124 cals per serve and they have a few different flavors, but honestly, you can't go wrong with vanilla. The thing with me is, especially in a deficit phase, I need at least one sweet treat a week. Like I need something to kind of end my night on, whether it's a hot chocolate, whether it's like, you know, a caramello koala, an ice cream, just something that I can kind of almost look forward to, if that makes sense. I just love, I love my chocolate, I love my ice cream, and it's something I will never give up, even in a dieting kind of phase, because I went years and years of you know, thinking it was so bad for me and that I couldn't have it. So now I'm all about balance. And if I can fit in a mini Cornetto into my day, you bet I will. <laughs> and then the last thing I got is just kombucha because it was on sale. This is my favorite flavor. If you've never tried it, highly recommend. It is the apple, pear and ginger flavor. It's so, so good. So yeah, I'm gonna make my lunch now. I'm gonna make chicken burgers, have a cheeky kombucha and yum. got my bowl of Nutri-Grain, which can only mean one thing. Also, I look like absolute shite today because it's been an admin day, so I've literally just been sitting at my desk writing programs. Um, but I've got my bowl of cereal now, which means I'm about to do a workout. It's like 6 p.m., so it's a little bit late, but yeah, let's eat this and get cracking. <laughs>
Okay guys, I officially have the best hack ever. And no, I did not come up with it. TikTok came up with it. The stuff that you learn on there, guys. If you are not on TikTok, like you need to be because wow, it teaches me a lot. Anywho, I have just warmed up my protein bar in the microwave because I've seen so many people do this and I'm not usually one who like loves protein bars. Like it has to be, like I have to be desperate. <laughs> However, ever since microwaving this yesterday, I think I found my latest obsession. It is so good. This is the one that I get. So it's the BSC um, cookies and cream flavor. Oh, so, so good. Highly recommend. I also love the chalk mint flavor. But yeah, if you haven't microwaved a protein bar before, definitely try it and let me know your thoughts. Like, can we just look at that Guys, i might have just done something a little bit naughty we just went for a walk this morning um ended up being like an hour and a half so that is a win at least but i may or may not have got something cheeky on my little walk and that is some donuts like look how good they look are you joking Basically, every single time that there's a lockdown, all I see on my Instagram account is people buying donuts, whether they're buying them for themselves or whether they're sending them to like a friend or a family member. And every single time I see it, I just instantly crave donuts. They're definitely my weakness, especially these type of donuts, but I have yet to actually buy them. Like I am proud of myself that we've done a year and a half of lockdowns and I have yet to actually get a donut. But today was not one of those days and I got a four pack. So. I'm going to cut them open now and I want to try, I don't know which flavor to try. I think I want to try the Biscoff one. I got Biscoff, um, strawberries and cream, a Nutella Kit Kat one and a lemon meringue. I wish you guys could vote right now, but you can't. So <laughs> this is happening right now. it's happening right now. Oh, that looks so Good. All right, let's do a taste test on camera. I didn't actually realize the strawberries and cream one had custard and I'm not the biggest fan of custard. So let's see how we go. I'd probably, I feel like it's like, doesn't really have a flavor. It almost just feels like a plain donut with custard. But this one, oh my God. Are you sure you don't want to buy it? Pretty sure. Oh my God. This kid doesn't like donuts. Like, who are you? <laughs> Who did I marry? <laughs> workout complete. I didn't actually film all of it because I did the same workout that I did the other day, which I don't usually do. I usually try to mix it up, but I actually really enjoyed the workout the other day. So I decided to do it again, but now I'm just in the pantry and I'm gonna make a protein shake because I'm on the weekend. I really struggle with protein because I mean, as you guys saw, I had like a bloody donut <laughs> as my snack, which has no protein in it. So I tend to struggle that tiny bit more. So right now I'm just gonna have a shake. I always use Happy Way. Um, my code is Happy Brit. If you guys wanted to use it, I think it's like 10% off maybe. Um, and my favorite flavor is the triple chalk. So good. So I'm going to have this, I'm going to shower. And then I think I'm just going to read my book on the balcony because it's such a nice day today. And I don't really have any plans, which we love. Yeah. 